With Maurice de Wardour, you reach the midpoint of what has become known as Donizetti's Tudor trilogy, although he had no intention at the time of this, these three operas are going to be a group, Anna Belena, Maria Stowada and Roberto Devereux. In this midpoint opera, we're really focusing on the relationship between two queens in the same island, Mary Stuart and Elizabeth Tudor, and the political impossibility of these two women coexisting within the same small island. It's based on the Sheila dramatization of Mary's story, which contains the great mythical scene which never actually happened in history with two queens meet and have a cataclysmic showdown. It crackles with drama, it crackles with romance, it, 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 it's, uh, it's a very, very, very powerful midpoint in the trilogy of these three operas. When I do a period piece, I'm very, very interested in trying to get either the period as exactly accurate as we can, or to find a more abstract treatment of the period that still powerfully suggests that period. When we did the production of Anna Bolena last season at the Met, we um, went for an nth degree historical accuracy, um, particularly in the costuming. With Maria Stuarda being a different type of opera, we've gone for a visual style which is freer, which is more romantic, which somehow, rather than reflecting history, reflects the romantic nature of this retelling of the story and the sweeping romantic nature of Donizetti's music. The tone and musical quality of Maria Stuarda is very, very different from Anna Boleyn, and that might surprise a lot of people that tend to think of the bel canto repertoire or Donizetti's operas as being quite generic that the music is somehow interchangeable with different plot lines. With the story of these two queens, you have opportunities for storytelling through pure music. What I've discovered getting to know these operas, working on them, growing to love them, is what a, a truly fine dramatic composer Donizetti is and how particular and pertinent each score is to the story that he's telling.